in horse racing. Sharon Smith has a look at pacing here in the uh, Edmonton area. This three-year-old Colt Pace in the British Crown Series is being held in Canada because pacing has been popular in Canada really for a century. In fact, during the time in the last century when uh, everybody wanted trotters in the United States, there were pacers in Canada. Don Fleming is a retired racing writer for the Edmonton Journal, and uh, pacing is very, very popular in this country, isn't it? Well, it really has been. I guess there's been harness racing here since the turn of the century, really, when uh, farmers would unhitch their horses from the plows and race down the country roads. But um, about 1912, there was a uh, racetrack on the south side that they used to have occasional meets. And then it sort of died out, and thoroughbreds really took over. And um, I guess back in the 40s, there was only one standard bred in all of Alberta. And meanwhile, Manitoba and Saskatchewan, neighboring provinces here, had one-day meets at all the little towns all over the place, and people here got interested in it. And um, uh, in 1961, uh, an undertaker by the name of Bill Connolly, he was a real racing fan, he used to go to the races at, at Southside Park, he decided, well, he'd try to revive it. Well, it was a great thing whenever they did 100,000 in a night. But uh, it, it started to grow rapidly, and with these major races like the Stuart Fraser, which is now is the richest uh, invitational race in all of North America with a $200,000 final, with those horses coming in and the big league drivers, uh, it, it's really taken off now. Pacing in particular, though, we don't see trotting races here. We did have uh, quite a bit of trot, uh, quite a few trotters here. When Al Grillo used to be the uh, racing manager here, he imported about uh, enough for a couple of fields, but they're pretty cheap, and uh, there's nothing worse than cheap trotters. They'd be jumping all over the place, and the fans didn't like it. And then we did have a couple of very good trotters uh, at one time, but uh, they didn't have any competition. They'd had a ra race against the uh, Pacers, and they'd be given the, the one hole as sort of a compensation. Well, we've certainly seen some wonderful Pacers today. This is Don Fleming, who is the retired racing writer for the Edmonton Journal.